Dean, welcome to Palace. How do you feel to have signed for the Eagles? Thank you. Um, no, I'm absolutely delighted. Buzzing to be here. I can't wait to get signed. It's a new club, new city. What excites you about playing for Palace and coming to London? Listen, I think uh, they've got great fans. They're a team with a lot of top players. Players that I think are obviously hungry uh, to succeed. And um, I think there's something getting built here and um, I really want to be part of it. It's been a big moment for you leaving the club that you've been a part of since such a young age. No, of course, I've been there for 12 years. I've had some good, good times and some bad times there, but listen, I'm really grateful for everything they've done for me uh, throughout my career, and I wouldn't be where I am today without them. So that, that chapter's over now. Um, I'm really excited for the new challenge here. And as I say, I just can't wait to get started. Yeah, the life of a young goalkeeper is a lot different to outfield players like with the amount of loans that you have at the start of your career. Does it feel kind of like a relief to be out of the loan cycle and permanently at another club? Yeah, I think this is what I wanted this summer. Um, I've got a, just had a little boy two weeks ago, so I wanted to settle the family down um, and kick on and find a new home. And as I say, just enjoy myself and be settled. What's your experience been in London before in the past? To be fair, I've only been in and out. Uh, we come down now and then with the missus and um, we have a walk around the shops and stuff and then obviously go back up north so it's completely different. So uh, just getting used to my new surroundings and um, we're really excited for it and can't wait um, to get moved down and settle. And the experience of playing against Palace, what's that been, been like? Yeah, years? I mean the fans are great at that end, is it the Ultras? Um, mm. They're always great, making a great atmosphere so um, really excited to play with them rather than against them this time. Uh, we've always had a close-knit group of keepers at Palace, led by Dean Kiley. What, what do you know about Dean and has he spoken to you already? Listen, I know he was a top goalie when he played. Um, I know of him just throughout um, being in the union, uh, speaking to him on the touch lines or after games and stuff like that. Um, so I'm really excited to get to work with Dean because I think he'll be able to help me a lot and to maximise my potential, so I'm excited for that. You'll be competing with Sam Johnson, who's a good mate of yours. Yeah, Sam's a top mate of mine, um, he was actually at my wedding last summer, so um, no, we're great friends and we've had phone calls and stuff, and whoever plays, each of us will support each other. And, um, I'm really looking forward to seeing him tomorrow, and obviously I know Remy Matthews really well as well, so that's good, so uh, the GK Union will be really tight. Yeah, and from um, the past as well, what other players do you know from England? I know Mark, uh, centre-half, um, briefly I've been in a couple of good squads with him, but I know how good he is, um, really looking forward to having him play in front of me, and yeah, I'm looking forward to meeting all the boys to be fair, because uh, it's an exciting time. In my extensive research, which was Wikipedia, it says you're a good cricketer. And that you, I used to be years yeah. ago, yeah. You played as a wicket keeper, they're always pretty uh, vocal. Is yeah, that yeah, something 100%. that you bring, you brought into your goal? Yeah, 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 aggressive, Quite. vocal. Um, yeah, you need to be. I mean, it's all about the team, communication is a big part of that, so it's something I've got in my game and I'll keep, uh, keep going with it. And um, just finally, obviously, is there'll be major competitions coming up for England, I guess. Is that another one of your focuses, just getting some games and trying to get the attention of the England manager? Yeah, listen, I always love representing my country. Um, and yeah, of course, that's one of my aims, to uh, go to another major tournament um, and get, get back with the England group. Um, so hopefully I can perform well enough to catch Gareth's attention.